Dynasty. We're here for Fantasy Focus. We'll hear from Matthew Barry about what he's watching, courtesy of Buffalo Wild Wings, and we'll start with Carlos Williams. Yeah, he's going to get the start today. LaShawn McCoy not expected to play. And, boy, I love Carlos Williams, one of only three running backs. All right, Matthew, 90 minutes before game time and these 1 o'clock kickoffs, of course, that's when we find out for certain these inactives. Matthew will join us. We'll be back right after this. Fantasy Focus. This week, we're offering you a chance to join us at the Super Bowl. You can win a trip, Coach. Coach is going to take last week's winter dancing. Uh, this week, in this week's contest, we're asking you to name a potential team in London. There's been some talk about putting an NFL franchise in London be the first entry. What you got? And I, got I do two. not know what he's going to say. I have two. Okay, fair enough. The Paddington Bears and the London Werewolves. Take your pick. Way to get tough with those Paddington That's Bears. That's right. That's right. Nothing says tough like Paddington Bears. Paddington Sports. Bears. Adam, uh. over to you. Well, we're taking a look at quarter. He's been moved to the slot this year and has not stopped. He's been extremely productive. But why the smooth transition? Well, it's a big buy-in. He decided to do what Bruce Arians thought that he could do and add not only to their offense. Mm -hmm. Most veteran players that have had success, they won't buy into what the coach is doing. And also the last two years, he's had a bad knee injury and mm -hmm. a bad hamstring. Mm -hmm. And he's healthy. Meanwhile, Tom, that Cardinals defense has already forced seven turnovers, three defensive touchdowns. They haven't stopped either. No substitute for having players at all three levels, your front line, your linebacker, two points a game if you want to play deep. Mm -hmm bit of a help and under new defensive coordinator James Betcher the cards have more takeaways and sacks in their first three games than they did with Todd Bowles last season boom all right Wendy thank you we're not this <laughs> Patty however Bears. and but, but, but we have winners have no. nobody's gonna you know yeah. we got winners though all right, oh I'm sorry we winner, do I these guys are not eligible the winner is well, right, we need to team in L.A. Hey, first. I just work here yeah, hey, what you, know what's you your excuse bring your mom <laughs> same excuse what? it's been a long Come time on. Muffins to the Super Bowl, they're eligible. Yeah, they're, oh, that's right. I'm sorry. Muffins. Yes, yeah, you will be one of 17 entered into the contest. We'll pick one winner and uh, have some English muffins out west, I guess. There you go. Well, we got a lot of 3-0 and o teams. On Sports Center, they are not unbeaten, but it is a pretty decent start for the Redskins. If they are to beat the 0-2 Giants tonight, what do they He's a pass-catching guy, uh -huh. and he's great from an exploitation standpoint of matchups and get him on linebackers and safeties, he's a mismatch. But what he's doing in the blocking game is the most impressive thing that I've watched. Off season, uh, they're one and one though. The Giants, 0 and two, who needs the win more tonight? I, you know, I mean, obviously you're playing at home. I would say the guys out aren't. So the bottom line for me is you dominate line of scrimmage in this league, uh -huh. you're gonna win 80, 85% of your games. And they're dominating the line of scrimmage. Don't go too far, by the way. Mark Schlereth has a bunch of other things to talk about, including the other games happening this weekend. For a team that says World Series or bust, it's kind of bad timing to be on track for your first loss in a month in the season. How concerned are you about how far this team can go when it comes to the playoffs? Well, I am concerned. I'm on the number one spot. Then there are three teams separated by a game and a half for the two spot. The Twins in the middle of that sandwich. They're one game behind the Astros. How can the Twins take control? Twins are 